What's up ladies and gents and welcome to our League of Legends Top 5 Play Show here on YouTube. We apologize about missing the last couple of Top 5s, there were a lot of bugs with low recorded that we finally got squared away, so now we're getting back on schedule. Without further ado, we go into our number 5 play with Yukimiya on Cassiopeia, and at the start we see Grogs initiate with a body slam into an ultimate, and then all of a sudden Nunu starts up absolute zero, then Cassiopeia ults 3 within his ultimate, completely turning the tides of the fight and countering their engage. Cassiopeia picks up the kill on Grogus, and then together as a team they follow up on the counter and take the double kill for Cassiopeia on Soraka, and eventually the 3 for zero exchange in such a close game. Landing a spot at our number 4 play, we have K and Big Fish on Jin, and at the beginning we see Tristana running away from Diana, using Rocket Jump and then Hecarim ults towards her and dives her, but she uses Summoner Heal, forcing him to retreat. Jana has other plans, monsooning him back into the tower and allowing for Tristana to get the kill, reset and escape with another Rocket Jump as Jana shields herself and bursts Diana with the help of the tower for the kill. Finally, Misfortune dives, but she tosses out a tornado and flashes perfectly past MF's E to secure the 3 for 0 exchange. Scoring into third place is Formigo on Oriana, synergizing really well with Irelia. With their team down on kills, they go for a desperation play, jumping in on the Baron as Oriana ults three players, taking Baron, then the instant double, followed by the triple from York, and then Graves dashes over the wall, but together they flash, hunting down Graves for the fourth kill. We now see Cannon chasing after Maokai, landing some clutch abilities thanks to his flash, and Maokai goes to flash over the wall, only to meet his end. Dashing away into her number 2 spot is Cookie Killer on Ari, who engages at the start with her ultimate, dealing huge damage and forcing the channel, but she lines up her Q on both of them for the double kill. She continues on and grabs a triple on Fizz with the last charge of her ultimate and then turns to Zyra for the quadra kill, but right before she goes down, she pops on, just switching the focus of the turret to Tark and allowing for zero deaths for Purple Team on that engage. And for our number one pro play for this week, we have Thang D on Gragas, and at the start we see the enemy team pushing to take the win, so he body slams into an ultimate, dealing huge damage, and then Q's getting the instant double kill. He ignites Garner, and the death fires into a body slam for the insane quadra kill in defense of the Nexus. They push the creeps mid and go straight for the enemy Nexus. If even one thing was different, even down to the small things like body slam ulting rather than walking up and ulting, then the enemy team would have pulled off the victory. Great target choice, insane speed, and a truly epic comeback. For the bonus clip of the week, we have RJ Salakori on Ezreal with an insane play under the enemy turret. As the clip plays, I just wanted to announce that we will no longer be doing player's choice and lucky plays on Saturdays and Sundays. With some feedback from many different sources, including crew members, we've decided to limit these daily videos to Monday through Friday to give everyone a relaxation period from the non-stop videos. We really appreciate your support and look forward to getting on a really steady schedule starting this Monday. Take care guys, I hope you enjoyed and as always, have a wonderful weekend.